What's up YouTube? It is your boy Toxic Bullets here with the video that has been waiting for you guys for a while. You guys have been asking me for this. So here it is. I have my setup vid and I'm gonna throw you all of my Zen 4 controls that are coming from this little thing right here and this little thing. I mean, even if you guys aren't using the Razer Tartarus and the Razer Naga like me, you could probably adapt to it still because basically the way I have it is how you should be using the keyboard. So it should be fairly easy for you. I'm just running you through this real quick. So these are the speakers I use. Usually uh, use these while I'm playing the game. Like, they're actually right next to my chair, you see? But uh, with these headphones right here, my PX, or not PX, uh, Recon 60 piece. Yeah, they're pretty good. Uh, you can hear the music even if it's right next to you. Like, it doesn't sound too loud or anything. So that's good. And then right here, I have my keyboard. I have my mouse. I have my Zen 4 setup. So, uh, one second. So, I had to turn that down. So basically, the Zen 4, I will show you how this works real quick. So, right here, you plug in your keyboard and mouse, and then in the back part, this part goes into your system to turn on the Zen 4, and then this USB goes into your controller. So basically, the Zen 4 is just working as a splitter to make your controller act as a keyboard and mouse. So this is just the converter for your keyboard and mouse. Basically, this makes it act as a wired controller, and this makes you able to plug it up to your controller and then use these as your controller if that makes any sense but uh yeah <laughs> um this video really isn't for how to set up the zim for but i mean just to show you how it works real quick i mean yeah that doesn't hurt but uh i will get into the controls of my zim 4 i'll actually like have screenshots and then i'll have uh i'll have the copy and paste so you can just throw that into your zim 4 settings and you'll be all good but yeah, thanks for checking this out, guys. I hope you like my setup. You know, it's not really anything too big. Like, it's just, yeah, just set up. All right, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, guys, we are back. I just wanted to speak to you about the keyboard real quick. Um, before I actually show you my controls, I'll just show you how my hand sits. So uh, basically, I have my move forward, left, right, down. Basically, my WASD. I have my shift right here for my sprint. I have my change weapons, so I move my ring finger up, I change weapons. I move my pointer finger up, that's my square, and I reload. If I want to hit my PS button, I do this, just the top button. If I want to jump or hit cover, this is my X. If I want to hit my D-pad or anything on my D-pad, this thing is my D-pad, this little circular thing. So if I hit it this way, that's my med kit, if I hit it this way. Then that's my grenade, I believe, if I hit it down, you know, emotes and basically all that, yeah. So, uh, then I have my mouse, which right here has a bunch of numbers on the side, and hold on, let me get a good focus. Oops. I want the lights to be too bright. Alright, fuck it. So, uh, here we have the three and the six which i use for my l1 so this is my heel this one's my pulse and then this one down here the one i use is my l3 or r3 to smack people and aim down sight so basically this is good because um you could keep your fingers on the aim and the shoot and then you could just press your heel whenever your health gets low so that's that's one thing that keyboarders do get away with is that because what a controller person does is they will put their middle finger right here and then they'll heal with their pointer finger and then they'll basically aim like that so the mouse makes it so you don't have to have three fingers on the controller I mean you have well yeah you basically got your whole hand on your controller I guess you could say but yeah, it's just a little bit more convenient and um, I cannot put my screenshots from my phone to my PS4 because I'm sitting here editing the video for you guys. 
but uh yeah i will still have the copy and pastes for all the like the grenades the aim down sight the hip fire i'll have all of that so you guys should not have a problem trying to get it set up all you have to do is just copy the code and then go to the paste button in your zim4 and then tinker around with it and make your own controls so yeah i do want to thank you guys so much for watching i greatly appreciate you guys you guys got me to basically almost 200 subs i have a feeling i'm gonna get to 200 subs real soon and i'm not even really active on this channel like that but you guys are still here and i greatly appreciate you again so thank you for watching guys and enjoy the you know settings and all that if you do use them and i will see you in the next build video that i am making Alrighty, have a good one guys